117, 2156. How you doing, sir? How you doing? Doing all right? Yeah, I'm doing good. Thank you, sir. Uh, uh. Oh, I, I already told him. Sir, sir, can you move your car, car or parking lot, please? You're parked on private property. Oh, is it? Yes, sir. You need to move it, please. Okay. You guys tow. What is it? What kind of parking lot is it's that? It's private right property. Animal colleges. Oh, is Animal colleges? Yes, sir. You need to move it, please. This. Uh, what, what's right here for Animal colleges in this building right here? What's that? What's in this building for Animal colleges? Animal colleges, sir. Uh, what's it? What do they do in this building? I, right I don't here? need to explain that to you, sir. Well, why please, move, you need... please move your car. Well, let me ask you this. If I was here, supervisor down here. If I was here to use Alamo Colleges, but I wanted to come over here first. But that's not what you asked me, sir. You said what's going on in there. No, you didn't ask me. Yeah, I'm that's asking what you, you what, what is this used for? Do you know what that's, it's used for? That's not, that's not what you asked me, sir. What, what's right here for Alamo Colleges in this building right here? Sir, I asked you to move your car. Well, actually, I'm, I got business here at Alamo Colleges, and I'm that's coming not what over you here said, to That's not what first. you said, sir. Actually, actually, you said what's going on in there. That's not okay. what you said. Well, I'm just asking you if you know what's going on in there. I know, I know, but I know what's going on in there, and I'm here to I'm here to visit out of my colleges. I think you got a problem with me sitting here no, filming. No, sir. I'm gonna go. I'll All have right. your car towed because you're on private property. Asking you to move it. Okay. I'm asking you to move the vehicle. Right. What's your name, guys? Right. Number. It's right here. You, you don't you don't say your name or anything like that. It's on my uniform. You're I don't not able. You're not able to do that. Cotham, right. C O T H A M. Please move the vehicle. I'm having... So I'm gonna go in and take care of my college of business. You're gonna tow my vehicle while I'm doing that. Just curious, yes or no? Simple question. You gonna tell my car while I'm in there? Well, I'll answer you. While I'm inside- I'm trying to get hold of my supervisor. Okay. While I'm inside taking care of my business, I dare you to tell my car. You'll pay to get it out, eventually. <laughs> and then I'm gonna come back out here and film these guys. You gonna escort me around? Yes sir, because this is private property. Sure, no problem. So I can't park here if I'm doing do I have to have a permit while I'm in here? Plainly marked. All the signs are plainly posted. Well, if I have to have a permit in order to go in here and take care of my business, but you didn't say what business you were here. You didn't say what business you were here for. I don't have to for. tell you what. Yes, I'm you here do. For. This is private property. I don't have to tell you anything. Yes, you do. I just have to move my it's car. It's not public property. Right. If I don't have a permit, then I have to move my car. But I don't have to tell you anything. In fact, yeah. I don't even have to talk. You can't to you. go in this building unless you tell me why you're going in there. It's private property. So that's private not, property. So the public can't walk in there and inquire anything? That's not what you said. I know, but I'm telling you that now. You, you didn't, don't have to point your finger at me, I sir. I can point my finger at you. What is your problem? Let me ask you, what is your problem? Four, can you send the supervisor down here? A11, I got an individual refusing to move his car. I'm not refusing. Property. I just asked you a question. I'm going to move my car, and then I'm going to come back and talk to you. So you just have your supervisor come out. You're, you're amazing. <laughs> I've been told. Huh? That's what I've been told. Oh, you're an idiot too. You've been told that. So that they get, so they make you a judge of people. <laughs> well, you're coming out here acting like an ass, man. Who said I was acting? I got like one? I got business here. I didn't realize you no, needed you didn't to have tell a. You have business here. I, but I don't have to tell you. Yes, you do, sir. You can't, Why? Go into a, you can't go into a building like that. It's not open to the public and just tell me I'm going to park here and go in there and I'm going to tell you why I'm going in the building. Well, I didn't know this is not open to the public. 
I'm looking on how to register for Alamo College. You don't register here. I didn't know that. Well, I'm just telling you now. You didn't ask me. I planned on I planned on walking in that building and asking. No, you didn't. You planned to park here on private property, walk down there just to film. Yeah, which which you obviously have a problem with me doing. I don't have a problem with you. So I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go park legally, and then I'm gonna come back down here, and we're gonna talk with you and your supervisor. That's fine. Good grief. You guys have a major problem. No, you have a problem. Oh, you got the problem. Thank you for enlightening me. You're an idiot. Have you have you and, and your supervisor come down and we'll talk. talk and we can talk about you being an idiot. Yeah, that's what I do, man. Part of a large civil rights organization. How do you get a part of it? Uh, we got we got a website and things like that. How do you get it when you're done? Yeah, whenever whenever you're done with these guys, we'll talk. So what was the reason that they stopped you? Which hey, uh, sitting out right here. Is stuff, this? Nah, that stuff was already there, I made. Is it this is uh, Alamo College's property? Is that what they're saying? Yeah. Is there anything you wanted to talk about? You got a supervisor coming out? Yes, sir. Okay, good. We're gonna wait for him or what? Are you gonna tell him where I'm at or I mean we're gonna he's gonna come here, we're gonna talk. Is that how it's yes, gonna sir. work? Okay. Do you want anything? Uh, any reason why they were stopped? Our property. We yeah. maintain the property line. Okay, we're. Why, I, why I'm just. Think, I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not trying to argue with this. Yes, you did. So you it's called me the idiot and asked. Did I, was I unprofessional to okay, you? Because. Well, no, excuse me. Was because I unprofessional absolute, to you? Absolutely. That's the way I, I feel. I was unprofessional? I, that's the way I feel. Did I call you an ass or an idiot? No. Well, why would you relay that information back to me? Because I feel that you're no, no, that, like an that, idiot that, with the things that you Okay, could you explain the definition of idiot from the dictionary? Well. Uh, whenever I come out here and I plan on going in the there and asking of an idiot, for, I, I'll give you the definition in a second. You ask me a question and then you okay. interrupt okay. me. Okay. I'm, I'm not. I'm not looking for a confrontation or anything like that. No, sir. I, I, I came simple, out here. I explained to you that you were parked on private property. Asked you to relocate right. your vehicle. You said, "Well, why?" I said, "It's private property." And you didn't. Well, what's this? You should have business here. If you're happy to have business when you don't know what's in the building, how do you know you And I said, yeah, I'm here to register. You can't register. I told you. I'm going to go in there. You can't just walk in a building without previous knowledge of what I'm going to do in a building. You can't just walk in here. I'm just walking walk in a building, which is private property, and I'm just going to wander around and conduct business, which I have no knowledge of how to conduct. I'm explaining to you. You call me an ass and an idiot, which I was not a professional to I you. I did my... I said you're acting like an idiot. No, you called me an ass. You're it's... acting like an ass, and then See? after you continued with your stuff, then I What's determined my, that you I'm were an idiot. My explanation of my job. Well, it's my opinion that you're an idiot. And I and I talked and, and I talked to you over here via one day. You don't remember me, do you? That's where you have the problem. Yeah. No, I I, I was waiting for a bus, and I and I know that you know you, what I do, right? I know what you do, and That's I know why your you're history. Off at no, me. I know your history. You don't know anything yes, about my history. I know your history. Tell me my history. Bear County what, Sheriff. What Travis County Sheriff. Honorably or dishonorably? Dishonorably. You're an idiot. That's where you're an idiot. See, all my service as a law enforcement officer was honorable. I left Bear County to Travis County to make more money. I retired from Travis County after an off-duty accident, honorably. So see, you are an idiot. You know these guys have. These guys are honoring their oath. They didn't say anything to me about filming. You want to come over here and say, move I didn't your say car. About you filming. You said I can't walk into a building unless I have a purpose and I tell you. 
That yes. that tells me you're an idiot because you know and damn well I don't have to tell yes, you, you anything. Do. I don't even yes, have to do. talk to you. Well then you stop talking again. You came up and started talking to me. I asked you to move your car. I walked up to their scene, didn't say a word. I asked you to I move was... your car because I observed you park illegally in our parking. You wanted me to move my car because you talked to me at Via. You know what I do and you hate my guts. You think I don't know did, you, did I, did I tell him Cotham. I hated his guts. The did reason that... I the re you don't understand. The reason I went over to Via is because the deputies and his own partner reported that guy. And I, I was, know I was catching a bus and you gave me a card and said here. Look, if if I have if I had anybody You got you got to listen to this. I know the conversations that you and Bowie have because your Bowie. fellow officers snitch on you. Bowie. As soon as you walked up, dude, I know who you are. You didn't know who I was. Why would you ask me? I don't know who these guys are, but I know who you are. I was waiting for a bus. Don't you, you get it? You act like this with people. There's some officers that don't like that and they feed us information. We're much bigger than you think, you know. Well, we we got tons of people. Me, why would you come give me a business card and know me and ask me if I knew any, if I would, if I had issues or if I was the same, doing any rogue cops? The same reason Bowie was threatening to say what he would do if I ever showed up, and I simply walked up and said, "Can I ask you a question?" The same reason know, I I don't even know your conversations or your interactions with Bowie, but yeah, yet you're you're you addressing do. me like I'm I'm in with him. You do. You say you don't, but you do. Yeah. I was going to ask, and you never answered me. The, um, so how far does the property for animals we, extend? We, we, we maintain that. We maintain this. You notice the sidewalk is the texture. Yeah. And the rest of the sidewalk. And you notice how we have grass. We have to maintain and cut. Yeah. So you you're, you're, you guys come all the way out to the curb, That's or, or just the problem, all the way out to there. We have to maintain. Well, you, you see the damage they've done right here. Well, yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, I don't. The, the, I'm not questioning you guys. No, 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 what you're doing. This is why we do what we do. Yeah. Look at, look at this. Well, they drop all kinds of stuff inside there. We have this right here. This has been damaged. And this is like a vent to a window. I mean, they, yeah, they look, look at this. We had this out here, which we had to put, which is been destroyed. The plumber is you know. So that's a destroyed light. It looks like a light or something like that, but it's all messed windows, up. You know how much this cost to replace it? It's all messed up. The windows are scratched here, so they obviously the windows, have a reason. Got windows to... broken out. We had yesterday. We had a maintenance had to come clean up to my defecate up against our building. So, you know, they obviously have a reason to keep people off of this grass, even if it weren't, whether it's uh, university property or not, um, they definitely um, are, you know, there's all kinds of damage to the building and things like that. So, you know, it's completely reasonable that they're running people off of here. Yeah, and normally the way it works is, you know, th this is our property. These sidewalks aren't owned by the city of San Antonio. We it doesn't have an even matter, here. man. They're fucking shit up. Yeah, and all he does is we encourage him to get off of here because they Absolutely. do cause some damage, and that's why he's here. They did everything 100% correct. Yeah. And now, as far as you parking on our parking lot, we usually do not have an issue if you're here for official business, like to register or whatnot. But if you want to film something on Alamo College's property, you some, and you're going to be on the property, you have to get permission. Right. You know, you have to go to Student Life or Student Activities and say, hey, look, can I have permission to film on your campus? And, you know, we'll help you. We'll escort you around in need be. Honestly, now, Sarge, honestly, sure. Sarge, well, we both know this is a public sidewalk. So it's kind sidewalk, of, yes. So yeah, you can so, actually stand here if you right. want. Which, which, is, which is what we make sure we do. Yes. And, you and know, so, and I'll cut that out of the video. Um, but, you know, it's just a public sidewalk. Yeah. And, and, and uh, I know you guys okay. don't give anybody. See, that's the thing. I know you guys don't run people off if they park there and go inside. Even yeah. if, even if they don't do registration here, if somebody were to park there, go inside and say, hey, "Do you guys register here?" and they're like, "No, you need to go," you guys aren't going to say anything. The whole problem was is that we have history, yeah. um, only that he knows who I am. Sure. And I just feel that that was the motivation for sure. treating me the way he did because yeah. I think if it had been anybody else, yeah. they wouldn't have got that response. Okay. So I just wanted to bring it to your attention. Sure. We're a large yeah. civil rights group. Yeah, and it yeah. amazes me sometimes that there are some officers who know, like Via. Yeah, they they knew who we are, mm -hmm. but yet they come out and for a good eight or nine minutes. Yeah, I had an officer like this with his flashlight, and everywhere I turned, he was like this the whole time. Yeah, I'm not joking. Wow. And I'm like, guy, okay. okay. you know who we are. You know what we're doing. Sure. Why would you do that on a camera? Yeah. So, am I bringing to your attention? Sure, sure. Perhaps like I'm not telling you what to do, but if I were a supervisor, I would say, yeah. hey, look. You know, treat treat him yeah. and everybody else that you don't like yeah. like everybody else. So we're downtown. Uh, the guys you see out here on the street. Most of them are honest guys. They're just looking for a uh, you know work. They, they stand out here all day uh, looking for work. People come up and pick them up. Um, this is uh, right near the Bio Central Plaza. 
you guys remember the Via Central Plaza where we've uh, done some audits with the Transit Authority? Um, over here is a parking lot for the Alamo Colleges. The officers I was just with is Alamo Colleges Police. And uh, you know, there's a, a mix of right and wrong out here. You know, the officers are out here and they gotta, of course, keep people away from the buildings. Uh, there are some folks here, not all of the folks here, but there are some uh, folks here that are part of the criminal element. <coughs> and uh, you know, they end up damaging buildings and things like that and making, uh, you know, scaring people and whatnot. The police have a, a difficult job out here. I mean, they have laws that they have to go by. And at the same time, uh, they also have to uh, deal with uh, some of the criminal element out here. So I don't envy their job. Uh, but what I do expect is that whether they like someone or not, um, they need to treat them the same as everyone else. So it looks like uh, I'll be being out here for a little bit, talking to some folks and uh, see how it goes. I think the police are gonna mind their business now. So you guys asked me why I'm out here. So the reason I'm out here is because um, I understand that you guys are out here looking for work. There's people out here, part of the criminal element, makes it kind of hard for you guys because it attracts police attention. For sure, yeah. Right? For sure. So, uh, and so what happened to you? They gave me a ticket, a 500 dollars ticket of seeking employment. For seeking a five hundred dollar ticket for seeking employment. Employment. Yeah, that's fuck. That's beyond. What is it that you did to get that just, ticket? Just right right here. Just cross. The truck was over there, and I went straight out there. Hey, ah, ah, ah. Come here. Give me a ticket. Five hundred dollar ticket employment. And for sitting down there, they give me camping ticket. I was tired and went like this. So, so you were. How were you? Like this. And you got a, a you camping got a, ticket. A camping ticket. And I went to court. I said, yo, yo. Let, let me ask you something. Uh, the camping ticket. Did you uh, did you have a tent out here? None. I just by myself like this. Did you have a, a fire? No, no, nah, nah, no fire, no fishing rod, no axe, no machine, you want, no you grill. Want, you want roasting marshmallows? <laughs> let me ask you. S'mores. At s'mores. any at any time, were you fishing from the bank here on the street? Were you fishing? No, no. So how can you give me a key ticket? No, no, no trees out here? Nothing. So how can I give me a camping ticket when I want to court as a junior? I want to go to trial. So no trial. But you got a ticket for camping. Yeah. 